Hello guys, Mini Money here. Today we're playing a new game called Until Dawn. So yes guys, this game isn't actually new, it's just free on PlayStation Plus, so I thought I'd give it a go and record it for you guys, but it looks pretty cool. So I'm gonna be a, it's going to be another um, sort of game in the series where I'm trying to change up the channel a little bit. Um, we're playing different games other than FIFA, FIFA and Rocket League, because FIFA's kind of dying out at the moment, uh, with FIFA 18 on its way, which obviously I'll make so many FIFA 18 videos, it'll be unbelievable. But right now, the new series, Mini Miner Plays, is kind of what we're going for here with, you know, playing things like Luigi's Mansion and uh, Life is Strange and also Until Dawn. Now, I should probably mention beforehand, if you don't like, you know, blood and all that, and you're a bit scared by things like that, I recommend you clicking off the video because it is an 18. And if you don't like all that stuff, I'm pretty sure I put like a, a disclaimer at the front of the video because it might not be nice if you want to, you know, have your tea while watching this. A lot of my videos, you can have a bit of popcorn or have a cup of tea while watching whether it was this one you gotta be a little bit more prepared because I don't even know what's coming and I'm not a big fan of all that sort of stuff anyway like I don't mind I'm playing uh, Resident Evil at the moment and that is cool but this one I don't know so we'll have to see uh, playing Resident Evil in VR actually uh, which is absolutely incredible it's a, such a good game um, very scary in VR I'm hoping this one's gonna be a little bit less scary because I'm not in VR but we're gonna choose traditional controls and this is it life is dawn it's created by Sony as you can see right there and pretty much it's very similar to the life is strange series where you can kind of each each of your decisions affects everything affects the whole game and there's so many different there's thousands of endings there's oh god okay uh, there's thousands of endings they say I'm gonna turn my volume down my headset I gotta be honest um, the thousands of endings on the game, so you can't, no two games are the same, if you know what I mean. So here we are, until dawn, and, uh, yeah, let's see what's, let's check on the settings first, I don't wanna, um, I think we should be okay. So brightness, yeah, fully all the way, just so you guys can see what's going on. Audio, that's fine, I'll take that. Uh, control options, that's great. Subtitles, let's put subtitles on just so that you guys can understand what people are saying that's always good and that will be about it was sidebar text oh okay that's playstation camera stuff okay we're gonna start a new story i'm not sure what this is about but we'll have to see it's until dawn on the playstation plus on the playstation store are you ready guys oh the butterfly effect a tiny butterfly flapping its wings today may lead to a devastating hurricane weeks from now tiny butterfly like devastating hurricane. Oh, I'm not liking this already. Oh god. This could be funny. The smallest decision can dramatically change the future. Your actions will shape how the story unfolds. In this series, you could be seeing me getting scared by this. Your story is one of many possibilities. That's what I read up on. That it's not just one story. Please don't be a jump scare now. That'd just be sad. Choose your actions carefully. I will. That is it. Okay, we're at our house. Looking forward to this series. Should be interesting. I found Life is Strange is a bit weird. But this one, pretty cool. Alright, hello. Deborah again, is it? There we go. Nice day ish, not really. It's freezing. Okay. Oh, who's that? Ah, okay. Bit of a party going on here in the snow. Just looking out for my brother and 
Okay, this is... It does have a sense of horror about it, you know? This is survival horror. I don't know if you can hear the PS4 or not, but it is making a racket right now. The fans are going crazy. It's Hannah. Hey, Hannah. Let me just check the uh, ventilation here. Hey, who's this guy then? We call him Dave. Right, Dave is approaching the house. Oh. Okay, what am I meant to do here? Just walk around, is it? Third person. Oh, Resident Evil is bad enough. This is going to be. Interesting, isn't it? Jeez, Josh. Once again, brother, you've outdone us all. Mm. I don't know what's going on here. I think you can probably tell by my silence. Pick up the note then. Oh my gosh. What did our naive sister get herself into now? Got your note? This doesn't look like horror to me so far. This is a very strange game. Oh, it's a prank. Oh, right, I get it. Okay. Bye bye then, Hannah. You're going to be killed. I can already tell. Find others or wake Josh. Oh, I didn't. Oh. Josh. Josh. Yeah. All right, that hasn't worked. Okay, this is strange. Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? It's she ran away, mate. She can't take a joke. It was just a prank, Han. What did you do? We were just messing around, Bev. It wasn't serious. You jerk! Hannah! Oh, now she's gone. Hannah! So, is she gonna go after her? You know, I kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now. Press the correct action button before time runs out. Okay, ooh, square, okay, got it. Now what do I do? Fast or safe? Let's go fast. Power. Come on. Um. Follow the footprints. Gotta be, isn't it? Actually, that's a stupid decision, isn't it? Maybe. Mm, either way, I don't know. This is the whole point. This is this whole game is about decisions, and they're from those. Typical.
Um, use touchpad as shown. Slide. There we go. I've slid across on my touchpad. Now what do I do? Status update. Yeah. Very modern here on this game. We're using our phone as a torch. Which is very good. Um, now what do I do? Oh my gosh. What was that? Hold that one to walk faster. Hello? Pick up that. What is it? What is it? Death totem. What's that? Totem prophecies. Black death. The possible death of the person who finds it. Indigenous tribes believe that butterflies brought dreams and premonitions. Each totem piece foretells a, fu a possible future event. How you play will determine whether or not these prophecies will come true. As you unlock totems, the events of the past will become clear. Okay. Okay, I get that. Okay, that'll do. I understand. Ish, not really. Uh, right. Where is she then? Why are we just walking off? That's the stupidest thing I've ever seen. Oh, fire breathing dragon up there. What the hell was that? Fire breathing dragon. I've told you already. Anna. Who's that then? Anna. Hello? There she is. Look. Ready for her to Anna. be killed? Oh my god, you must be freezing. Here, take my coat. I'm such an idiot. <laughs> so dumb. Now bring her back then. What's going on over there then? Oh, what are we running from? I can't see anything. It's falling over, of course. Typical movie and game style, actually. Oh, and she dropped something. Oh. Typical. There's going to be a decision up here close soon, is there? Nope, we're just going to. Who is it? No. Alright, they've fallen down and pretty much died. Oh no, they haven't died yet. No. Fall in the snow, it's nice and soft. No. I'm really dragon on. is coming to get you. Hold on! Um well, I'm gonna let go. Might both fall into the uh, nice snow together. Dead. I thought that was soft snow. Two of them have died already. Who's this then? Doctor Hill. There are a few things I need to make sure you understand. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. We have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom in progress. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on. Is he talking to us or someone else? To the future. I think he's talking to I us. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. A bit close. So, you have committed to commence with this game this week. And I want to help you see it through. Okay, Sometimes thank you. Sometimes each 
sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through. Perfect. Thank you, Dr. Hill. All right. We will start with the simulation. Now. All right. Go for a job. Could you please pick up the card? Oh, okay. Maybe not then. I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. It is essential that you answer honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. Okay. Let's have a look then. Oh, okay, it's a uh, scarecrow in a field, like a barn sort of thing. Okay, I get that, yeah. So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. It makes me feel, you know, fairly happy. It looks fairly nice. Oh, it's peaceful. Yeah, peaceful. There we go. Oh. Isn't that you? Yep. But would it make you happy to spend the whole week here all by yourself? Yeah, I suppose it would. That wouldn't be so bad, would it? Better than, you know, being killed. Uh -huh. And what if I told you that this party was haunted? Then I'd probably be a little bit scared and I probably would stay home. Oh, what lies beyond the veil of death is after all the ultimate. This is a weird bit of the whole game. And what could inspire fear more than the terror of uncertainty? Oh, I'm sorry we're out of time for this session. We talk again very soon. Okay. I don't know what you have to play in the whole film. Not the film, the game. So, I am going to leave now. And let you get back on with your scarecrowing, or whatever you like to do. Right. Okay. Sony Computer Entertainment. Interesting, I don't know what's going on. Until cool. Liking it so far. Hayden Pantetti. Stormare. We're seriously being forced to watch the whole credits. Yep, I can skip. Okay, we can't. Well, the dead. Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. I know that. That's me. They're dead. There is one individual working I caused them to die. Of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Well, thank you for joining us, Anthony. With all the Washingtons tonight, their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fan. All right, let's do that again. All right. Well, hello, friends and fan. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter.
never get away. <laughs> so, um, let me just right, let you know, this is strange uh, now. I don't know what's going on. Address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's going to be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year. But I just want you all to know um, it means so much to me that we're doing this and that okay. I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're we're all still here together and I'm thinking of them I really want to spend some quality time with with e each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for for the sake of my sister and I'm not sure about this guy already okay so I'm unsure about it. I'm not like really sure stars, okay? what Make it's about, one really. Trip we will never forget, all right? yes! <laughs> he seems weird, that guy. I'm not sure if I can trust him yet. Oh, come on! I've seen all these. Pretty much half this episode has been watching credits. Why are they singing a song about death as well? wherever we are ten hours until dawn okay that's uh oh not you again hop over the fence I'll just open it that's a good idea Sam, Hannah's best friend. Considerate, adventurous, and diligent. Interesting. And looks like about to be killed. Hello? Hello. Someone there? Yeah, me. No? Okay then. That's the cable car station. Alright, let's go to the cable car station then. There's the cable car station. There seems to be a big gate. I suspect that. All right. Climb over. Climb up then. Uh, let's go safe. We don't want to. There's nothing to worry about here. It's not worth chasing anyone. Oh. Very easy. Climb. Triangle. Square. Guess we're here. Wherever here is. Oh. Hey there, fella. You hungry? Huh? <laughs> Eat. Whenever it says don't move, I'm not moving. That's what it's meant to say. I'll just put it down on the desk. That's easy. And what am I meant to be doing next? Head to the cable car station. Right, I get that now. Okay, I'm not unsure anymore. Thank you, tutorial. You can go. Thank you. I don't like all these birds flying about as well. They're just annoying. Right, what's going on in here then? Can I have a look in there? Cool. 
What? Oh, no. Is that good? Yeah, I've read that now. Come on. Oh. A bird will come and fly away. That's... The future is uncertain. Whether or not the prophecy comes true is decided on the... Okay. Guidance. Right. Get that now. Okay. Pretty interesting. I'm quite liking this game so far. It's interesting. It's a different point of view to uh, Resident Evil. Chris, uh, you here. Right, let me go in there, then let me, uh, let me go on the cable car, I guess. Maybe not then, we'll forget about going in there. And there's a bag, let's have a look in the bag. Not in the bag, are you? Okay. Ooh, someone's going to bring in, let me answer that. Yeah, I'll have a look around, I guess. Just to check if we can find any interesting uh, things. Because there's no point. When you're in a game, you might as well just... He knows it. Oh, okay. Method... Methodical? Methodical? Yeah, that's right. Protective and humorous. Couldn't say methodical then. Right. There he is. Uh, I'm sorry, are, are you my secretary? Cool, well, thanks for letting me know. I can take it from here. Maybe that was the wrong choice. Oh, so I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you. So, come on. All right, we're going to see something amazing. That's, that sounds cool. Right around here. It's going to blow your mind. Blow your mind. Let's have a look. Let's see what blows our mind. Have a little look. Attention to detail in this game is pretty good. Footsteps actually, you know, exist. Clue found wanted poster. Victor Milgram. July 1998. Collect clues to solve the mysteries of Until Dawn and increase the chances of survival. Okay. Ta-da! Ta -da. What is it? Red, right? What is it? Yeah. What is it? Uh, beauty is not the word that comes to mind. Why is this even here? What do you mean? What the hell is a shooting range? Oh, shooting range. Uh, dude, have you ever met Johnson's dad? I'm Chris now, am I? Have I changed to Chris? I have. Oh, that one there. Boom. Killed. Boom. Boom. Easy. Wow, nice secretary. All right, I'm bad. I'm a badass. I'm gonna go ahead and guess it was a wild goose in the killer's club. Huh? I don't think so, girl. See that one? Excellent. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. I'm not shooting that squirrel, am I? Nice shot. You're actually shot. Jackpot. Hey, it's your turn to ride the bike. Wait, I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, cable car. Okay. 
butterfly effect update. Status update. Right, our cable car's arrived, apparently. The camera angle's here a bit weird. It gets a lot of getting used to. We've already yeah. checked that door, look. That's one of those stupid marks. Put people out. Says that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station. Oh, he got key. That's good. Because otherwise, that's stupid if we can't get in. Well, right, not the door then, mate. Right, and lock the door. Good. Now what do we do? Have a look then, let's have a look at what's uh car was closer. Must be on way. I'm sure it's just the appeal of the same time as the shooting range. How far is this place out? It's a big mountain. Alright, let's have a look in here then. Like with Pine, Hutton Satorium for a healthy body and mind. What a crazy place to set up house. No matter how rich you are. Only far mountain. Okay. In here, maybe? What's this? Computer? Some CCTV, maybe, that looks like? Not really sure. Not of any use, really. I guess the cable car's arrived. Alright, let's go in the cable car. This could mean death. I guess I should enter it. And after we get up there, I'm probably going to end the episode right there because it's been just about half an hour. So, uh, I'm liking this so far. It's an interesting storyline. Intrigued to find out more. And I like the idea that every single one of your decisions affects it without having to the ability to go back in time and change it, like in Life is Strange. I know Life is Strange is a pretty good game so far, but I, from first impressions, I'm preferring this one at the moment. Don't know about you guys, let me know in the comments. Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. And we didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. Sounds like I was never. If it weren't for the fact that you moved to Hand six degree like Riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. Okay. Seems like a pretty good place to end the episode. Alright, maybe not then. Can I pause it? I think I can pause it. When we get up the top. And start moving about on our own again. I will. There we go. Jess might be your girlfriend. Show you a confident, trusting, irre irre irreverent. Irreverent. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. Never heard of that word before. Right, I guess I will have to end the episode right there. So that'll be about it, guys, for the first episode of Until Dawn. Hopefully, you guys are enjoying 
the series so far. I'm enjoying playing it. Let me know what you think in the comments section. If you want any other games, uh, if you want me to play any other games, then be sure to let me know in the comments section as well. Leave a like on the video on the on a video on the video if you show that you are enjoying it once again. Subscribe if you're new to the channel so you never miss a video. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in my next video.